You're now watching another episode of Shoot Your Shot TV. My name's Paul. And before we get into it, just want to say that we've reached a milestone over here on our YouTube channel. We finally surpassed 100 subscribers. I think we're like at 110, 115. And I know that's chump change in the YouTube world, but it means the world to us. So we just want to say thank you to you guys, everybody who's watched the video, all y'all that have been rocking with us from the jump. And if this is your first time watching our channel, watching our video, go ahead and subscribe right now because... Maybe when we hit 200, 300 subscribers, we're going to go ahead and do a giveaway or something fun like that just for you guys. So, again, thank you, but we're going to keep it rocking. Moving on to today's episode, we got another classic out of the Nike vault. We have these. Boom. The Nike Air River Dirty, And it's just another classic, man. Can't wait to get into it. You already know. It's Shoot Your Shot TV. Shoot Your Shot Records. River Dirty. A River Dirty. Nike recently brought back another classic model from their ACG collection from the 90s. They brought back the Nike Air Rivederci, which is a play on the Italian word Arrivederci, which is Italian for goodbye. And these shoes were originally released back in 1992 when Nike was still trying to reach their outdoor consumers and provide them more comfortable, stylish shoes with rugged, sustainable materials for the outdoors. And you know how we feel about ACG over here at Shoot Your Shot TV. If you haven't already, please check out our review on the Nike ACG Dog Mountains right here. But back to the River Dirt Cheese. It's a shoe that we've been looking to pick up for quite some time. They dropped back in 1992, and I think they re-retroed sometime in the early 2000s. We weren't able to get them then, but we have them now. So let's go ahead and take a look at this iconic ACG classic. The River Dirt Cheese. The Nike Air River Dirt Cheese. Oh no. All right, let's go check it out. So here they are, the Nike Air River Dirty in that classic OG colorway, which is a light gray, hyper purple. They call it red plum on the box. You got the gold lining around the ankle right here. Black with a speckled midsole. And the shoe just feels very solid, very sustainable. You have this super solid sole on the outer right here. Great for traction. And you have a gray rubber mud guard on the front of the toe. It's very inspired by the Hirachis, which released around the same time in the 90s. And it has this Hirachi nylon booty right here. And I just, I love this material. I love Hirachis. I love the Air Moabs. They use the same technology. And it also has this crazy ankle support lacing system right here. In black nylon with a black nylon pull tab. So we put them on easily. And yeah, it's just a simple looking shoe. Not too much going on, very minimal but still good colors to catch the eye. You have the Air River Dirty logo right here on the insole, and you have that Hirachi branding on the tongue, Nike Air on the back of the lacing system, and it's a pretty good looking shoe. Let's go try these on, but before we do that, let's get a smell of the outdoors. <sighs> smells fresh. Let's get it. A River Dirty. I really like these. I really love ACG. I really just, I'm glad that Nike's bringing some of these back and they're not making it too limited or too exclusive to cop. These were an easy cop. We were able to just pick them up on sneakers the day they dropped. No hassle, no fake sellouts, and they still have a bunch of sizes available. So if you're interested after this video, go ahead and cop you a pair. But I really feel like the shoe fits perfectly. It's not super comfortable. There's no like crazy bounce there, but they're comfortable enough, especially if you're going to be outside doing outdoor activities. This would be a great shoe for that. Great shoe for camping, rock climbing, mountain biking, maybe hit K2 or Mount Everest in these. And yeah, Nike 
can always go back into their archives and bring back some heat, especially some things that we haven't seen in a while. Uh, I know they're doing other colorways. They're really pushing their go outside campaign. And these are perfect to go outside in. So when you're not watching our channel and you're going outside, grab you a pair of Air River Dirt Cheese right here. They fit true to size. We got a nine and a half. They fit perfectly. And for a price point of 140, it's not too bad, but you might be able to catch these on discount later down the line. But if you can't wait and you're ready to just go outside right now, go ahead and pick up a pair of sneakers at. But yeah, that's our episode for today. Arrivederci. No, I'm just kidding. But yeah, it's Shoot Your Shot TV. Thanks again for tuning in. Thanks again for watching, subscribing. Hit that like button, drop a comment below. Let us know how you feel about Nike ACG collection. What ACG models do you want to see them bring back? And do you like this shoe? Is it something that you might want to cop down the line or totally not for you? Let us know in the comments below. But again, that's our episode for today. My name is Paul. We outy. Shout out Good Rad Ugly in the Game Ball Podcast. And arrivederci. Bam. Just want to say that we've reached a milestone over here at our YouTube channel. Today we're reviewing the Nike Air Riverdurchi. It's another shoe for you. The Nike Air Riverdurchi, which is a play on the French word Riverdurchi, which is French for goodbye or something like that. Uh, we weren't able to pick them up back then, but we got them now. We picked them up on the Nike sneakers app. So let's go ahead and take a look. <laughs> <laughs> I was running out of breath.